Well, let's let's preface this by saying, sex is just great. <laughs> I think it depends on the sex and it depends on the food. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Like I was joking earlier when, you know, when Liz is doing yoga, as much as I love food, not better than sex. <laughs> <laughs> yep. It's basically. just not. Um, you know, I, I think that, especially for chefs, when you talk about food and you talk about sex, there are two things that uh, invoke passion. You, you, know, you describe them the same way. Absolutely. The way you talk about food, it can be, you could be talking about sex all day long. Right. And it, it, they just, they go hand in hand, as they should. Because again, like you said, they just bring out this passion, this love, and this this desire and want and need for, for two fantastic things. Right. Liz and I have been together for a long time, probably almost as long as you've been alive. So <laughs> tw like, you know, we, we met in 1989. We met in the restaurant business. So from 1989 to... 2010 we had never taken a new year's eve off you know it was the busiest night in every restaurant in 2010 we finally said fuck it we're not going in the night we're going to enjoy the night by ourselves so we did <coughs> lobster um crab artichokes lemon um truffles like poached in butter and we literally sat like vikings in front of this beautiful fire at about 10 o'clock and just started eating food with our hands. It was the, by far, the most romantic, sexiest, wonderful dinner I've ever had with my wife in 20 plus years. And of course, we fell asleep before 12 o'clock. <laughs> it was a very sexual meal. Yes. yes I, and then we were so excited to be off for New Year's Eve, we fell asleep by 11.30. We woke up at 2.30 and had a wonderful New Year's yes. Day the next there's day. There's something to be said with eating with your hands. Like, oh. it's, it's, I, I love it. My girlfriend, like the first time I cooked for her, we made pasta together. Uh, we hand rolled it, we made the dough, you know, like fed it through the machine. And it was this like shared experience and it's something that she had never really done before. Um, and something that I find very calming and, and it oh, puts you at absolutely. ease, right? And you get to, you just go through this process together. There's flour everywhere, you're having a good time. Um, and, and you're just feeling, it's, it's this, this hands thing. It's touch and stimulation, yeah. you know, yeah, and the I feel of beautiful. food. The process of food is, is sexy and it's mm -hmm. romantic. I think what's the, I think the most, Stimulating for me is being able to cook with whoever you're with and cook together and get your hands dirty and share an experience together. Yep. That sets it up for the meal and then that will make your meal sexy. And then hopefully you don't eat too much that you fall asleep. It but happens, it's but it fun. doesn't matter. You wake up and you do it.